it's Jamie here. I just wanted to do my week 15 video and this week I want to do an airmail theme because I'm sending a lot of packages and letters this week so just dedicated to that week and let's get started. So the washi tape I'm using is this airmail washi tape. It's red, white, and blue striped and I'll be using some the red and dark blue skinny washi tape and this is from Michaels and I believe this is from Michaels as well so I already did this page and we'll do this one so I'm putting it at the bottom here Line it up as close to the edge as you can. Okay. And I'm using my cutting board. I purchased this from Daiso. And I use my, I always call it a scalpel, but X Acto knife. And just cut that off. And now I'll do that to the top. Just place that at the top. I'm just covering up the other languages. Let's say April. Okay. Cut that off as well. I'll be using this red thin wash tape. Let's see. Let's see. Either I'll put it here on this side. Kind of put it on this side. And I love using this thin washi tape. It's so cute and easy for your pages. So I'm just lining it up with the, the edge right here. Just right at the line there. Because I don't like to cover the middle, the blank middle section, because I like to write brackets. Okay, uh, I'll just use my scissors to cut this off. There we go. And I'm using this white washi tape, and I'll show you what I'll do with that in a minute. Yeah, you're thinking white on a white page, but I'll show you what I'll do with that in a minute. Okay, so just try to line it up with the edge and straighten it out a bit. So to me, I love decorating my pages like this because I only do smash booking. And I would love to do Project Life, but can't afford it at the moment. It's a little pricey, but in the future. And I don't do scrapbooking, so this is kind of like scrapbooking for me. It's a great outlet as well. I love decorating and using all my washi tapes. So this one, I'm just going to put right to the edge here. A 
little hard to get it at the very edge without going over. Just cut it off at the line there. There we go. And let's straighten out this a little bit. And straighten this top part. It's a little crooked. Oops. So, one girl, I got a comment on my last video, how I record, cause it, and, and she said it's so cute, and my husband records me. So if you see how is it zooming in or following what I do, that's my husband recording. And I'm lucky to have him record for me, because I don't have a tripod. Sorry, I keep fixing this. There. Okay. Next. So here I did, on the white washi tape, I just did Happy Mail, Mail Day, Letters, Sincerely, P.O. Box 75001. That's the zip code of France. Please handle with care. So I just wrote in some post office related words and I'll do the same with this white washi tape here. So I got this pen from Daiso and it says permanent marker. The wrapper looks like this. And I, I saw washi tape pens but I didn't know where you can get them and I saw this one at Daiso and it's 0.8 millimeters and 0.4 millimeters. So I'll be using the 0.8 millimeter, oh, uh, the 0.4 millimeter tip, which, see, it's double sided. And I'll use a smaller one. So here I'll just write, see, please deliver. Just stuff you would see on packages. Mm. What else should I write? Happy mail, mail day, envelope, stamp, just in different writing. Mailbox. Box. Delivery. There we go. Just to give it some post post office theme. Okay. And next I wanted to add some some stickers. I have this one that my husband got from me from the post office. And it's the post office airmail. And let's see. I think I'll put it down here. Yeah, put it 
down here. It's covering my hole. That's okay. I'll cut it off later. I'll just cut off that a little bit. Some postage stickers. Um, these match more. Or I have this flags. Not sure entirely what I want to do. with a more modern theme so these are kind of too cutesy I'll definitely want to use this one it says don't forget seriously don't forget so I'm mailing out postcards to some pen pals so definitely don't want to forget for my pen pals so I'll write that up here Okay. And see. have some of this. This is the masking sticker set, pastel version. Let's see if I'll use any of these. Oh, this is the pastel version. Mm -hmm. I use these Martha Stewart craft labels. They were spice labels, and I got it 50 cents at Big Lots. It was on clearance. And I already used the labels, but I wanted to use... I always save the stickers, because I could use, the, use it as boxes. So let me cut... Let me just cut a few and see what it looks like. Because once I use the labels or stickers, I can always use what's left over and not have to throw it away. Because there's still stickers. these few boxes. I'll just cut it again. I really don't like throwing it, things away. If I could reuse it or use it for something else, then I'll use it. See, these can be stickers too for labels or Okay. And these match the red theme. So these I just wanted to put just around some times. So I just so I can highlight important stuff. So I need to mail out, let's see, I need to mail out letters on Monday. So we'll do that in the morning. So maybe around from 9 to 11. Get that straight. There we go. And some, some decorations on this day, on this side. It's a little hard to take off. Um, 
Thursday, Friday. Friday. Thursday, I like to write letters as well. In the afternoon, so I'll do that around here. One more. It's so difficult to take off these backings. There we go. And let's see, Friday. I'll use some decoration here. Say sat on some on Saturday. Okay. There we go. And I have one more sticker. I bought this at TJ Maxx. It was in a pack. And it had this airmail right here. I thought that would be perfect. And this one. Let's see. It's on this page. Maybe around here on the top, on the bottom, no, on the top, there, no, around the top here. There we go, there we go. And so I have some clips here, just clip it. And I'll add this clip over here. It's a smash clip from the Smashbook Can Company. It says yes. It's like a airmail pointer finger. Okay, and I also have this airplane paper clip. And I wanted to put that on the side here. And if you don't know yet, April 8th on Tuesday is free cone day at Ben & Jerry's. So if you're willing to wait in those long lines, I recommend going to that. And I just want to write that in. So I usually use the same coordinating pens. And these are my Pilot G207 pens. And I'll write that in blue. Just right at the top. Ben and Jerry. So hopefully we can go to that too. And that's it. Now I'll just put in my file pack. Here's my file fact. Okay. And in the next video, I'll show off these dashboards from Paper Addict. And I want to show you my No More Spend April tick checklist. So I already spent Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. So I'll be checking it off that I didn't spend.
because I want to save up more this month. And here it just says, if I were granted three wishes, purchase a home, trip to Paris, and a new car. And this is just washi tape, and this is some empty skinny washi tape. And these are just motivations why I'm not spending and saving. So I'm putting that in mind as well. And close that up. And yeah, these are from Paper Attic by Kathy V. Her Instagram is Kathy, C-A-T-H-Y underscore V-E-E. -E. So you can buy that from her. And I love it. It's great. I'll just put this in next week. We're all set. Thanks everybody for watching. Take care. Bye.